Well, let's talk about Peloton bikes at the front page of the uh, FT this morning. One crisis to another for Peloton. <laughs> well, this is true. I mean, they really were this kind of piece of equipment that was the must have. They were on everyone's Instagram. Everyone was talking about it. It's this cycle that connects you to other cyclists. Obviously, it's a, an exercise bike. And that was the, the point of difference, really, that you could exercise en masse. And I think a lot of people who are missing the gym memberships really enjoyed it. Their sales surged. Everything was going well. And then, as you said, it's been one PR disaster after another, including the fact that I don't watch it, but Sex in the City, a major character, had a heart attack on there. Yeah, just a big. Right, OK. So this is about the fact that they have had an internal project called Project Tin Man, which has been trying to quickly repair rust that was starting to show on models and still ship them out to customers. Now, it's a really interesting piece on the Financial Times when you start to look at the effect of how brand reputation is so important to any organization you can be the sweetheart of the moment but if consumer confidence and that kind of authentic way of doing business starts to wane it really can start to eat in because those consumers then start looking for more to unravel and i think it's just a lesson learned to everyone that it doesn't matter how well you're doing you have to be really careful and to ensure that authenticity in all you do if you go out and say these are premium pieces of equipment they need not be rusting and if they do you got to do not, something about but it you know it's not entirely their fault is it i mean the, obviously the the sex in the city incident wasn't their fault it no. wasn't, but it did have but then they they did a very clever recovery ad which I think Ryan Reynolds or Hugh Jackman or someone was behind that had the actor involved in, who's then since Who been, later. been yes. sort of accused of, of, of inappropriate behaviour. Mm. And so it's just, do you think it's the end for them? No, but I think it's that flying high ideal. I mean, what happens with anyone who takes a lead in the marketplace is the competition starts heating up too, and I think that's also affected it. Mm. They're also having to look at things like price rises on the membership. That starts to affect it. So, of course, this is much bigger than just the communications piece. But we've got Oscar, a comms expert there on the end, who I'm sure will agree <laughs> how important it is to get it right. No,